heart of a quaint German kingdom, there resided a young prince named Friedrich. Prince Friedrich was a kind and compassionate soul, beloved by his people for his gentle nature and generous spirit. However, despite his many virtues, Friedrich was often lonely, longing for a true friend who could share in his adventures. One crisp autumn day, while wandering through the palace gardens, Prince Friedrich stumbled upon a peculiar sight. There, nestled amongst a cluster of trees, was a goose unlike any he had ever seen. Its feathers were as white as freshly fallen snow. Its eyes sparkled with an intelligence that surprised Friedrich. Intrigued by the unusual creature, Friedrich approached cautiously. To his surprise, the goose waddled over and nuzzled his hand, emitting a soft honk of greeting. Friedrich smiled, feeling an instant connection with the feathered friend before him. From that day forth, Friedrich and the goose became inseparable companions. They would explore the kingdom together, the goose leading Friedrich on grand adventures through forests and meadows, across rivers and valleys. Together, they discovered hidden treasures and encountered magical creatures, their bond growing stronger with each passing day. However, not everyone in the kingdom shared Friedrich's admiration for his feathered friend. The palace advisors and courtiers scoffed at the prince's unusual companion, ridiculing him for choosing a goose over noble companions. They whispered cruel words and plotted to rid the palace of the goose once and for all. One fateful night, while Friedrich slept soundly in his chambers, the jealous courtiers devised a wicked plan. Under the cover of darkness, they captured the goose and imprisoned it in the darkest depths of the palace dungeons, far from Friedrich's reach. When Friedrich awoke the next morning and discovered his friend missing, his heart sank with despair. He searched high and low, calling out the goose's name with tears in his eyes. But alas, his beloved companion was nowhere to be found. Determined to rescue his friend, Friedrich embarked on a daring quest to the dungeons. With the help of his loyal servants, he navigated the labyrinthine corridors, facing perilous traps and cunning guards along the way. At last, they reached the deepest cell, where the goose was held captive. Friedrich's heart swelled with relief at the sight of his friend, but his joy was short-lived. The wicked courtiers appeared, blocking their path and demanding that Friedrich abandon the goose and return to the palace. Refusing to abandon his loyal friend, Friedrich stood his ground, his eyes blazing with determination. With a wave of his hand, he commanded the palace guards to stand down, revealing the strength of his resolve. Impressed by Friedrich's bravery and loyalty, the courtiers bowed before him, acknowledging his noble spirit. They released the goose from its chains, allowing it to soar freely once more. From that day forth, Friedrich and the goose continued their adventures together their bond stronger than ever before. And though they faced many challenges along the way, their friendship endured, proving that true companionship knows no bounds. As were their adventures spread throughout the kingdom, Prince Friedrich became known as the Goose Prince, a title he wore with pride. And together they lived happily ever after, their friendship serving as a shining example of love and loyalty for all who knew them.